Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in. I'm Jody, and this is Jody right now. I'm in the process of recording a series of videos in an effort to finish out beta vlog every day in April. I did really well in the beginning of the month but then got behind, but I still want to finish out. So I'm going through and answering the questions that Amy Schmidauer from Savvy Sexy Social provided uh, to people who are participating in beta. So today's question was for the 19th, and it is, are you a morning person or a night person? Well, this is pretty easy to answer. I am hands down a night person. I have tried to be a morning person, and it just is not me. And she asked in the question, why? Well, personally, I blame my mother. <laughs> my mom was not a morning person. And so, much like we have trained Alton, our golden retriever not to be a morning dog. My mom, I believe, trained me and my sister not to be morning people. I don't know if that can really happen. I've, I always feel more productive later in the day. I always feel more productive at night. And therefore, if you stay up at night, you're gonna wanna sleep in. And even when I do want to or have to get up in the morning, I'm a, what I call a slow waker upper. Meaning, don't talk to me. Minimal conversation will happen. Maybe some grunting. So I have so much on my plate these days that I realized I needed to try to be getting up earlier because I need to be more productive. You know, there's only so many hours in the day and it's your choice as to how you spend those hours. So I got this book, The Miracle Morning for Writers. And basically, it's this guy who gives a prescription, if you will, for how to get up earlier and make that time productive. And I guess he developed the Miracle Morning, which is just a generic formula, and then he made specific suggestions for writers. I tried. It's just not me. What I did do was I did make an effort, and I lasted for a few weeks, of getting up at nine o'clock every morning. Because a natural waking hour for me it's like 10.30 or 11, and that just wasn't cutting it. So nine o'clock is at least manageable, and I'm trying to make that my goal. Yeah, and the last piece of this, which you might be thinking, well, what is Andrew, my husband? Thank God he is a night person as well. My parents' marriage, my dad was a morning person and my mom was not, and it caused a lot of problems in their relationship. So I didn't want that for me. I wouldn't say it was a reason that, you know, would have made me not want to be with Andrew, but it's just a lot easier when you're kind of on that same page. So yeah, that's my morning person or night person question. What about you? Are you a morning person or are you a night person? And if you are a night person, what do you like to do? I'm typically either watching TV or on the computer. That seems to be a rabbit hole. I can <laughs> hop down and just get lost for hours. So at any rate, thanks for watching this, guys. Please give me a thumbs up if you like the video and subscribe if you want to come back for more content. I won't always be answering questions again. This is just I'm trying to finish out beta. So um, I just really appreciate your support and watching. So until next time, thank you. Bye.